So, an action-packed first half hour of the British Grand Prix. Uh, he came to a very unfortunate end. He was given a black disqualification flag. And here he is having a furious argument with an official. He's very, very angry indeed, threatens what he's going to do to him, and storms away from his car. He was given um, a black disqualification flag, apparently, for ignoring a warning yellow flag. Well, um, I don't know whether we can cast a little bit more light on that. Uh, at least we have the Lotus boss, Colin Chapman, now talking to Barry Gill. Colin Chapman, why has Elio De Angelis come in? I really, I, it's not, nothing ever, I've never known this happen before in motor racing. Apparently he was black flagged because they felt that he didn't respect a yellow flag about 10 laps sooner. Uh, but normally, of course, if you're going to black flag a car, you get the team to do the black flagging. And only then, if the team doesn't black flag, then the stewards do it. I've never heard of this before. I just can't believe it. I, there's no way he should have been black flagged on the start line like that. But surely what normally happens is you have a minute's penalty, isn't that right, Colin? No, normally it's an admonition. They slow the car down, talk to him, tell him he's been a naughty boy, and then let him go. Not make him exclude, exclude him from the race like this. That's crazy. Colin, I have to say, it hasn't been your weekend, has it? You can say that again. Well, he's very cross indeed. And by the way, before we go uh, live to the event, let me say that uh, Gold uh, De Angelis out, but uh, Alan Jones is out.